good. He got to do what he wanted to. He played on his computer and went and played his drums and worked out. And I went and bought a bunch of food and cooked out. And his daughter came over to eat. And they were supposed to go to a movie, but it had gotten closer and closer to 7, 7.30. So they were like, eh. <laughs> I didn't want to go to a movie after that. So we all sat around and had some wine and stuff. And he... Uh, philosophized about why he wants to move to Germany <laughs> because his grandfather was German and he's finding that interesting so that's cool though I mean if he wants to research that and maybe do a genealogy with his daughter that would be kind of cool that would be neat for them to do you know learn the language maybe that that kind of thing that would be kind of cool for them and uh, so that's what they did and then <laughs> on such a door I what what was supposed to happen is I was cooking, Brie was going to come over and have dinner and then take her dad to a movie and then while they were gone I was going to call my dad so that I could talk to him uninterrupted without a bunch of people in the house making noise for me to be distracted and whatever. Well, because they didn't go to the movie, I that part never fell into place and, and so I was vlogging last night um, in my office which I hardly ever do because it's always so noisy but I was showing you guys and uh, <laughs> as I was saying happy Father's Day to everybody on camera it clicked and it was like oh shit I forgot to call my dad damn it okay well dude let me call my dad 9.30 at night and I know my daddy likes to go to bed early. Usually he's in bed before 9.30 because he has to get up super duper early. But I said I'm going to try to call anyway because I know my mom will be up. And um, so I caught him right before he went to bed and I told him I was so sorry for, for not calling until so late in the day. And uh, so now I just feel sucky. <laughs> I feel bad. <laughs> I'm a bad daughter. <laughs> but he forgave me and so I'll call him back this week and talk to him when he has more time and he's awake. So <laughs> but I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um yesterday morning my second video for the DIY channel went up. So I would really, really, really love it if you guys would go there and I will put a link somewhere on the screen so you can click off to that and uh, go look at that and tell me what you think. My table turned out fabulous and I am so pleased with it. Um, I can't wait to do the chairs, but uh, it's having time and resources at the same time, which sometimes always doesn't work. So. <laughs> but we do have a lot of other projects that we can do and stuff, so I'm excited about that. And uh, Aaron's going to be home today and I'm off tomorrow, so we're going to be shooting an intro for the other new playlist going up, um, which is a cooking playlist that she and I decided that we want to do. And it's going to be called My Inappropriate Kitchen, and you'll just have to come see why, because it's funny. <laughs> it's really funny. We have a good time in the kitchen. So, um, yeah, lots of innuendos. <laughs> So we're going to be putting that up hopefully this week if we can get the intro shot and render it down um, so we can add it to all the videos then uh, we'll be able to start posting that too and I'm not I'm still not sure what day that's going to go up and then um, we have, we're going to be working on getting our Etsy site up also. So I pretty much told her I have dibs on her the week, during the week when I'm off work because we need to get this done. and. Um, it's time it's past time so we need to do that um other than that the same old same old it was a good weekend i'm very pleased and um i'm almost done with 2008 of the vlog brothers <laughs> and uh so pretty soon i'll be caught up pretty soon and as a matter of fact i talked to my daughter and she said she did the same thing and as it turns out i in, i think in freddie's vlog i had mentioned that she has some of his books um, she, as it turned out, has all of his books, so I will be reading John Green's books because um, she, Aaron says that she really enjoyed the ones that she got to read. She hasn't, I don't think, read all of them, but she has all of them, so I will try to make time to actually sit down and read, which I don't usually have time to do. I usually just get 
audiobooks and that way I can play it play it in the background while I'm doing something else like sewing or whatever. So that is another goal um, to work into everything. <laughs> so as if my plate's not full enough, but I like to read and I miss reading. I haven't been doing a lot of it um, mostly because I've been just so busy and when all the kids were in the house, I never had time because it's like they have that kid radar where they know you're doing something so then they have to seek you out. So I don't know what's up with that, but that, it just seems to be the way it always works. So, um, oh, the lottery rolled over. It's 105. Nice. Oh, that'd be okay. That'd be okay. I thought I heard a cop car, but I guess I didn't. Okay. Well, um, I'm on my way to work, so I think I'm going to let you go for now, and I will talk to you after work, probably. Probably. Maybe Erin will be with me. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. Bye.